Hi Patrizia, Merry Christmas. Hope you're having a good break so far. Today I'm going to be presenting to you a video called Paper Hearts. This is a contemporary and hip-hop collaborated video choreographed by Carlo Atianza. Carlo from Vancouver is one of my old choreographers who I adore and appreciate so much and I chose this video because I wanted to promote him and the video. The video has a really emotional piece behind it, which if you watch the full video, is really prominent. The location is in a just simple, small, white room, and it simplicity immediately draws your focus to Carlo. As an audience member, I find simple sets are a lot easier to focus in on the intricacy of the movement, so that's another reason why I chose this. Uh, initially from the beginning, we see levels used, Carlo brings himself through levels by using direct focus to different body parts that are bringing him through the space. He is constantly using different elements to travel, such as when he's going to the floor, he will use sinking, and it's almost as if his body is like disintegrating into the floor, and we feel this melting sensation when he reaches it. There is a lot of sequential movement of moving through intricate body parts, which is really nice to see. That's the hip-hop aspect coming out, yet while it's in quick time, we also see a prominent use of light weight, which also creates some dynamics. Another really nice dynamic change is when he goes from being really bound into being super lightweight and super just almost dreamlike. Uh, I say dreamlike because I picture him being in a situation where he's like kind of reminiscing in the past or having a memory. We get the sense that it's emotional, so that can be good or bad, but if you do watch the full video, you will understand the concept behind it. Um, it's really nice to see him use himself and utilize himself as a way of moving. So he'll use tactile manipulation and use one body part to move the other to a different location, which is really nice. That moves really fluidly and he makes it look really nice. Uh, you can see with the chosen song, it has lyrics and it's really nice to see him dance through the lyrics and it's almost as if the artist's words carry him through his movement, which is really nice to see. Uh, we see other things used, such as moving like a screw. He does a few turns in there, which is really nice to see. And I feel like the movement, dynamic-wise, is just constantly getting yeah. thrown back and forth and really developing and changing. And if you watch the full video, you can see that prominently used throughout. Uh, I really appreciate how he uses his space wisely, even though the space is contained. You can still see that he really uses just, he reaches way out of his kinosphere to show that that sense of pulling past what he has left of him rather than staying very small and matching what the space contains. So I really appreciated his use of that. Um, yeah, I hope you enjoy the video and I look forward to seeing you in the new year. Take care.